Hi, this is Don Jonas with Care Ring. I uh, wanted to check in with you as our agency has uh, gone through this uh, COVID crisis. Uh, we've made lots of changes in the way that we provide services, uh, but we're still here and we're providing care uh, to people in need, just like we always have for more than six decades. And I'm uh, really excited that Dr. Karin Saylor, who is our medical director, uh, is able to join me for a minute uh, to tell me a little bit about what she's seeing in the clinic and her experience uh, taking care of patients uh, right now. So uh, welcome, Dr. Uh, Sayor. Do you have anything you can share with us? Um, yes, thank you, Don. Um, so our mission has always been to serve people in our community with limited resources. And in the recent months, we've just seen an increase in financial insecurities and um, medical concerns. Uh, in particular, a number of people in the community who either can't afford their previous provider or have not had a provider established um, have been having a difficult time finding a clinic where they can be seen. And we've been fortunate enough that although we are primarily doing telemedicine, we're also able to have in-person uh, visits. And just within the past week, I saw a gentleman who was here a week ago and had had weight loss and was very concerned and we were able to do um, an exam in the clinic and his lab results ended up showing that he was a new diabetic, highly uncontrolled. Um, we were able to get him in uh, within a day to get, um, get him set up for doing his own glucometer uh, testing at home. Uh, giving himself insulin. We were able to give him the supplies that he needed, um, talk with him about diet, uh, and then bring him back a week later to find out that he was feeling much better. His sugars were still high, but um, we were able to continue his, his care in the clinic. And he, um, in the next week, he'll be able to have a telemedicine visit uh, to continue managing his new diabetes and help keep him out of the emergency room or the hospital. That's what I was going to say. I think it's great that uh, you and your team are there uh, to keep people healthy and allow our hospital partners to do the critical work that they're doing, but there's still people in, in our community that need to stay well, and I, I appreciate what you guys are doing. That's a great story, and uh, for those of you who are listening, we uh, we'd love your support. If you're uh, interested in learning more about caring, or if you'd like to make a donation, uh, we would love your support. If you go to careringnc.com, it's a very easy way to make a donation to support us uh, during this time. Dr. Saylor, thank you so much for sharing a little bit about the excellent work that you and your team are doing. We're really thankful to be able to be helpful. Thanks. Take care.